stunning that you sometimes feel you have to be de-glammed in order for that acting prowess to show through. And also, this, this look of yours is so drastically different. So when you looked into the mirror, were you shocked, saddened? How, what was the first feeling? Saddened. <laughs> I'm like, even we were saddened. <laughs> Um, Transformation. <laughs> As actors, we wait for the opportunity where we uh, get the chance to essay a character and a role in its entirety. And, um, you know, um, the visual is, uh, is, um, prob is the most important aspect because every uh, waking day when you get off your uh, vehicle and get into your trailer and your tracksuit or however you come to work, it's important to become the character. So when you look into the mirror and if you see the character, believe you me, it's elation. That's, uh, and um, I mean, that's just, I probably even use that word because you have used saddened. I don't even think we go through elation, you just become. You just become the character and that's, uh, that's something that has always been important to me uh, as an actor and that doesn't uh, remain subjective only to uh, uh, the genre of film that we're today talking about. That, that remains true to every genre. It's important when you look in the mirror, like we have the highest respect for our makeup tools, for costume. We always call that Saraswati. Every uh, morning when we come to a trailer, we will not. We'll see to that our feet are not on the table. Um, you know, it's 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 respect of the highest order, and um, every aspect of um, getting ready to go face the camera is um, crucial to bringing to life what's written, and that's why we always mention and reiterate and reiterate team effort. Every professional who is there on a set contributes to bringing what you see here on celluloid. So it was important for us to play Dalbir, especially as Umang has already shared with you um, that, um, and you all can see and you all know, that we don't uh, necessarily, we don't physically actually look like each other, even in terms of height and everything else. And um, yet um, Umang was very clear that he said, look, I want you to essay this part. So you're playing Dalbir. So let's create a character together where uh, you, at the end of it, come away experiencing, feeling, believing Dalbir's story. And that is what is important. And it is very gratifying to have evoked the response today in your applause. Of course, for the entire film, but none of you went, eh? when you have looked at even the poster of what I've essayed. So if you feel uh, it is the story of all characters belonging and it feels real and feels true, then we have succeeded. And then, of course, we bring together all the tools that we need to, to, to bring that truth, that honesty to the character essayed. So if we felt that, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's reality. We have Dalvi Ji on board. So it's reality, Her, uh, we, we've got referencing in terms of the material that you, the media, have documented to gauge mannerisms. Beyond that, I have not spent time with her uh, before the film. In fact, I even met her for the first time on the first schedule of our set, I did not, of our film. I did not meet her in advance. Because when I'm playing real life characters like this, where actually you don't obviously see a similarity, it's important for me then as an actor to remain true to the director's vision and the director's narrative, while nuancing the character in a way that when you see, as he said, when she speaks, when she's spoken at public forums, then there is a certain natural uh, use of hands. There is a certain physicality in the way she expresses herself. That's referenced by what you have documented. So that is something that we have brought to for those occasions. But then I have not necessarily sat and watched every little twitch, blink, sniffle or smile of hers to only reference that. It's important to remain true to what we are remoting on a day-to-day -day basis. Also in terms of physicality, while on one level we could have gone down the fact, uh, the path that um, a lady who is going through this kind of hardship and strife over 23 years. Now you can hit either of the uh, spectrum of change in physicality. Either you can show loss of weight because of the kind of uh, stressful lifestyle, 
or the other way around. And uh, we chose together to go the uh, other way around. I remember we both smiled about it. And um, Umang is a dear friend. I've known him for long. So he just says, you've just lost weight. You sure? You want to go the other way? And I was like, yeah, let's do it. And of course, we did it with costuming and you know padding and all of that, and really building on uh, the, uh, the physicality of the character in the timeline of the film. And then little little things like obviously with stress, you could be uh, she, you could be prematurely graying. Uh, we have changed the color of the eyes of the character. Uh, Delbiji does have a mole, and he felt that was very important to remain and keep that true and real. Um, and uh, you go through pigmentation, you're, you're in the sun, you're, you're stressed out. So there's a certain, that kind of natural uh, reality we have brought to the, uh, the visual uh, uh, conception of the character. And in that, you can bring in a similarity to me as saying her in reality or even otherwise in the natural graph that you can imagine a character going through um, in her life and what that would do to what you would visually see. So that is something we have maintained even in terms of the lines of the clothes and all of that, you know, so, or the color or the fabric. I mean, it's that kind of thought on a daily basis to what was she doing that day and would she just be mindlessly wearing her clothes or would she even be thinking about it given what she's going through? So it's that kind of thought that goes into. And the reason I'm translating all this is because sometimes you all don't, do not know. We don't talk about all this, actually, on, on a public platform. But that's how we work on characterization on a daily basis when telling stories of, of this genre and uh, with this intensity. Oh